studying in Sweden affords you affordable tuition. That is, their tuition fee is low, comparing it to other destinations. Also, there are a lot of scholarship opportunities for international students. You can get half or even um, close to 100% in scholarship for your undergraduate and your master's studies. Also, students can work while studying, and there is no limit as to the hours that you can work as an international student. If you have study gap, that is when you completed five or four years ago and you want to continue your education, most of the institutions do accept study gap. There is no exemption. Now, also, you qualify for a one-year postgraduate work permit after you are done with your studies. But with that, as you, you school in Sweden, you getting your permanent residency comes easy. There are a lot of opportunities in Sweden that will guarantee you um, your permanent residence. Also, you can uh, travel with your family, that is your husband or your wife and your kids. Same applies to Finland. So you can move with your family. And the last one also is that as Sweden, the mode of instruction for international students, most of the schools um, is English. So you wouldn't find it difficult integrating into um, the system in Sweden and also integrating or learning the subjects that you are going to, the course that you are going to read. And the last thing here is that acquiring your visa or your visa acquisition isn't that difficult comparing it to other destinations that we have in Europe and US or Canada. Getting the most important thing is getting the required document. If you need any assistance, don't forget to follow this page. Other videos, the schools and the process for you to get admission and for you to get your visas to uh, pin in the comment section or in the videos that I've been uploading. Thank you.